A lot of people have been complaining on how this update is so small that Sunbear only has these three quests. So let me tell you that Sunbear is going to have way more quests, like a full on quest line that may even be up to 20 quests. And more of that in a second though, because you will also be able to give Sunbear a present. Yes, a Christmas present from Bee Bear to Sunbear. And I'm not entirely sure if it will be a decoration, but there will be a brand new ornament with new buffs. But imagine like a new decoration though. What would it even be? Or even imagine if Sunbear had a Beesmas quest. Not gonna lie, that actually seems possible. And we did also get a brand new sticker in Bee Bear's catalogue being the waxing crescent moon if you do scroll down towards the end for 400 snowflakes now. Really, really good for the people that are still struggling on it. But right, so talking about the quests again now, and it did say that these quests are really easy because they need to be completed by newer players, and that she had to release these three because the event was so close, and then that more advanced quests are planned with the mechanic for the future. So I'm guessing she's talking about golfing there, and because because all of you guys were complaining on how easy these quests were. Watch him now make it the hardest and worst ever stickers imaginable for the entire Sun Bear quest line or even have stickers at least that are quite hard to get. Like that would be funny to see just because everyone was complaining about it. And also speaking about golfing actually it will stay in the game forever it seems like and probably get changed and worked on as well for the actual Sun Bear quest line. And what he will add to it is probably maybe like more ball tiers like a golden ball like a diamond ball or obviously higher levels and a golf blessing too and he will most likely put it in different fields too for the sun bear quest line so like mountaintop field for example the 35b zone so the pepper patch for the last quest maybe like getting a hole in one in pepper patch as he did say that he will definitely expand on it but then though i really do wonder if we will get a sun bear cub buddy after finishing the entire quest line since imagine how cool that would be like that is literally all i want from sun bear as a reward when finishing it all and i'm sure a lot of other people would too. Like it's not even a bad idea and what else could we really get as the final reward from Sunbear? And also Sunbear will be staying till probably the end of Beesmas but this event will end August 11th so that's probably about when we will get more new quests. And I'm not exactly sure how many new quests Sunbear will receive like it will probably be either 10, 15 or 20 quests which 20 would just be perfect but I do understand maybe on it doesn't want to do that much. But at this point if Sunbear is back you know it may as well. But it's so crazy though like how Sunbear is actually here. This is the first time ever that every single NPC in the game is here together all in one. Never thought this would happen before, but it did happen. Like, bro, just look at this, bro. Beebear over here just chilling, and you have Sunbear right here. Definitely the craziest years for Beeswarm Simulator. Yeah, so if you guys are actually struggling still in this business, make sure to check out this video over here and this video over here too.